In this lesson, you're going to learn three kanji characters that describe motion, entering, exiting, and standing. Very easy to remember too. Let's learn the kanji for standing. This kanji character looks like a person standing. The on reading for this character is Ritsu, while the kun reading is Ta, used in Tatsu for example. Kokuritsu means national and uses the on reading of this kanji, while there is a verb tatsu which means to stand. Next kanji character is for entering. The kanji looks like the one for the person, but it's slightly different. Try to remember this kanji as the entrance of a tent. The on reading used for this kanji is new, while there are two Japanese ways to read this kanji, hai and i. Examples for this kanji character are new in, which is hospitalization, hairu, which means to enter, and ireru, which means to put in. The final kanji for today is exiting. If you want to be crazy, you can try to remember this kanji as a middle finger coming out of the box. The on reading for this kanji is shutsu. The kun readings are de and da. Dashutsu is a word that means escape. Deru is to exit, while dasu is to take out. These verbs are opposite from hairu and ireru from the previous kanji character. And that's it for this video. If you like it, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more lessons in the future. See you in the next video. Bye bye!